The Abbreviated Fox and His Skeptical Comrades This LibriVox recording is in the public domain. A certain fox had a Grecian nose and a beautiful tail. His friends were wont to say, in a jesting way, a divinity shaped his ends. The fact is sad, but his fox ship had a fault we should all eschew. He was so deceived that he quite believed what he heard from friends was true. One day he found in a sheltered spot a trap with stalwart springs that was cunningly planned to supply the demand for some of those tippet things. The fox drew nigh and resolved to try the way that the trap was set. When the trap was through with this interview, there was one less tippet to get. The fox returned to his doting friends and said, with an awkward smile, My tale, I know, was comme il faut, and served me well for a while. When his comrades laughed at his shortage aft, he added, with a scornful bow, Pray check your mirth, for I heard from Worth they're wearing them shorter now. But one of his friends, a bookish chap, replied with a thoughtful frown, You know today the publishers say that the short tale won't go down. And upon my soul, I think on the whole, that the publishers' words are true, I should hate, good sir, to part my fur in the middle, as done by you. And another added these truthful words in the midst of the eager hush. We can part our hair most anywhere, so long as we keep the brush. The moral is this, it is never amiss, to treasure the things you've penned. Preserve your tales for when all else fails, they'll be useful things in the end. End of The Abbreviated Fox and His Skeptical Comrades